This video will demonstrate uh, how to view revisions as well as how to promote a revision. So uh, here in the uh, Project Explorer, you can see I've got this project here highlighted and showing as revision one. Um, revisions start counting at zero, so that automatically means that I've got a revision uh, created for this. And to uh, see those, you can go to view and you can actually see the comparison. This uh, revision one is at uh, 44.7. This is at uh, 33.9. And so uh, this is also marked as as sold. So obviously um, this is a revision that was created once the project was sold and then changes have taken place since then. And um, you can compare the any two revisions against each other. You can run a comparison and um, we'll show that in another video. But um, there's also another function here uh, that we want to talk about here on the view option and that's promote as project and a scenario for that would be let's say uh, this was my as sold right here this revision that was locked down and here changes have been made and the client uh, gets the change order and they reject the change order well um, instead of opening up this file here the revision one which is the only editable file and deleting out all those changes and reverting everything that you've done, any modifications, any additions taking out, um, add back what you took out. You can always just go here uh, to the view and uh, highlight the revision. I've only got one here right now. And choose promote as project. And you've got two options here. Promote as project and make current project a revision. That's the safest way to do this because um, that revision one that's sitting out there at uh, 44.7 up here, um, it'll come down as a revision here in the list. So you can always refer back to it and all that. Um, this one, promote as project only, will just promote this zero up to this level here, and um, you won't get a backup copy. So this is the one I'm going to demonstrate, uh, promote as project and make current project a revision. Um, it's just going to verify that you want to do this. Choose yes, and here you can see rev1, which is this one right here, the current project file. Um, don't change the name. Um, you can actually, but uh, you probably don't want to. Like, don't make this revision two. That really won't mean anything to our software. This is always going to be considered Rev One. Uh, down here, you can make the notes, and you can just say um, maybe client rejected change order. Now, you can make more detailed notes about what what changed in the project file, like uh, the stuff you added, the stuff you took out, if you really want to. But um, this is going to be a simple example, so I'll hit OK. And now what's happened, as you can see here, um, the view menu is still expanded. Uh, Rev1's down here in the list, so I've got a copy of this. These are the read-only comparison copies. And out here in the grid, um, you can see the price has been restored to the original one because Rev0 was copied up to now revision 2. 